Morgan and today's video is going to be on the J Sculpt Fitness Belt and it's going to be on their newest belt which is the reversible one and I just want to give you guys an update slash review because my first J Sculpt Fitness Belt review was in 2018. That was three years ago. So I felt like it was time for a new update because it is 2021 and the brand J Sculpt has came out with some new belts and I just really want to get into it and show you guys because um, I upgraded from my first belt and now I have the new one and I just want to tell you guys the difference and show you the difference and also I would like to tell you guys my experience from me wearing it in 2018 um, to now so uh, you guys stay tuned. Okay so real quick before I show you guys the new belt um, I just want to talk to you guys really, really fast, just wait one second, really fast, about my experience from 2018 with the first belt that she came out with. So the first belt she came out with was not reversible and the strap did not come off of it. So it was just like all one piece together. And y'all, I got that belt and it was kind of a few months before summertime. And that's the summer that I was traveling. I went to DR, China, Thailand. Canada, LA. So I was like, I'm about to get my body all the way right, okay? So in March, I believe, I started traveling in June. So in March, I got the belt, started wearing it very, very consistently. Like literally every single workout, I was wearing the belt, okay? So I'm gonna post a picture here of what I looked like after three months of wearing the belt. Also with proper eating, okay? and um, intense workouts. So y'all, when I say eating is very important, it is super important, I was not cheating, nothing. So these are the results I got um, in three months and I was wearing the belt every single day, every single workout, and I looked amazing. I was so excited. That was the best summer body I ever had. So after you know all that, I continued to wear the belt. So I have been wearing the belt for almost three years and I was like it's time for me to get an upgrade oh yeah and also before I start um, I'm gonna link below my first review of the first belt that she had it'll be linked in the info box below so you can watch that in case you want to see it and she still does have the older belts on the website but this is all about the new belt today I'm so excited to show you guys all right, so, so I was like, it's 2021 and I want to get my body right again for the summer. Um, so I got her newest one, which is the J Sculpt Reversible Belt. So this is what it looks like. Um, it looks like this, and this has been worn. I have been wearing it for a while now. Um, so I broke it and everything, but this is what it looks like. So this side has all black solid on it. And then you can reverse it, which is so cool to me. You can reverse it to this side, and it just says J Sculpt all over it in black and white, which I thought was really, really cute. And then it comes with the band. So this Velcro band, it wraps around the belt, which I'm gonna show you guys in a second how you put it on and all that. But yeah, I usually wear mine on the black side. And then this also comes in black and gold. So I know some of my friends ordered this belt and they got the black and gold one also. So it's really just preference. I really like the black and white one. So I'm gonna show you guys how I put this on and let you know <laughs> what to expect when you first put it on. All right, so here is my body yaddy 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 yaddy. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to show you how I put this one on. Um, I'm going to be wearing it on the black side. So when I put it on, it's so simple. You just literally put it on like this. Um, and you're going to just zip it up. And when I zip it up, instead of pulling the zipper like that, um, sometimes my hands get like sweaty or they might be slippery. Um, instead of doing it that way, I'll take my two fingers and like pinch it and pull it up just like that and it comes up very very easily and I also like to take my sports bra and my shorts 
take them out from under and just have this belt on my skin. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. All right, so I have it on now. I just had to do it off camera because if I did it on camera, it's a little TMI, you know, with the body and everything. But yeah, so this is what it looks like now, just the belt on. And here's what the back looks like with just the belt on. So now I'm gonna take the strap and I'm just gonna wrap it around. Oops, it's upside down. That would help if it was the right way. Thank you. Okay. So you can make it how tight or as loose as you want. I put mine kind of like not too tight, not too loose, because I want to feel like that compression going on. Make sure it's even. And y'all, the Velcro on here is super, super sticky, which is great. So yeah, so this is what it looks like when I have it on. And let me turn around. It makes the booty look good back there. All right. All right, so that was how I put my belt on. Very self-explanatory, very easy to put on. Um, I love how it has the zipper instead of the clasp. Um, the zipper just makes it so much easier to put on and just zip up, especially if you're on the go or, you know, you really want to put it on quick. Um, so yeah, I will say when you first put it on, from my experience, when you first put it on, it is a little challenging because you have to get it like stretched out a little bit and make it conform to your body. So like after the first two or three times you wear it, work out in it, it's really easy to put on. So y'all saw how like easy it was for me to put on in one try. Now the first time I put it on, baby, no, I was struggling and that's like, I mean, that's normal because it does need to sculpt to your body. So after that, it's all good. Um, a lot of my friends have got the belt. A lot of my coworkers have gotten the belt and I told them before like, don't be scared. Don't think that you got the wrong size because you got the right size pretty sure it just takes a little bit of effort to put on when you first get it and also I do wear a size medium in this belt you can go on the J Scott website and they have like a measurement guide so I just put my waist measurement and they ask you a question about your hips and then um, they give it your size so mine came out to a medium and I am definitely a medium if I would have gotten a small that thing really would not have zipped up but I am a size medium in this belt and for reference I'm 5'3 I weigh 165 um my bust is between like a 30 well I can wear like a 34 or 36 bra um usually a 34 feels better but also I wear a size 8 or 10 in pants depending on what the pants are or it's size 29 so those are my measurements for reference. So some things I really love about the belt are that it's easy to put on. It is extremely comfortable, y'all. Like sometimes when I take the belt off, I feel out of place. Like I just want to keep it on because it feels so, so good. I just love, I, you know how babies like, like being coddled and swaddled in the blanket? Like that's how I feel with the belt on. I just feel so secure and I just really like it so it's comfortable um, it's bendable and movable and y'all I had I do it intense intense workouts so it's very important that if I do have a fitness belt that it is one that I can move around in and do all the exercises that I need to do without having is any issues so this belt does allow me to do all that it doesn't roll up, it doesn't do a, none of that. No issues at all. I have done so many different exercises in this fitness belt and I have never had any issues with it. And y'all, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I did post a video of me working out in this belt. Um, and I will also add it to the end of this video so y'all can see if you don't follow me, but you should follow me on Instagram. Um, but I did post a video of me working out in the belt and I also posted a reel of me putting it on if you guys want to see it, it again. It's on my Instagram at Beautiful Morgan, so check that out. And this fitness belt does have boning in it, so I'm going to get up again and show y'all real quick. 
but the boning in it is very flexible and it's bendable so underneath here um, the boning is right here so where you see this line this is like boning but it's very like bendable and flexible like I'm able to move and bend and not have any issues with it and y'all I have a short torso so at first I was a little when I first started wearing the belt I was a little hesitant um because my torso is short and I'm gonna scoot back so this belt stops right here um uh, like right kind of like at my hip and it starts all the way up there so it stops at literally the perfect parts so I don't have any issues I'm able to you know like do all this stuff and bend and all that so it's all good and also I'm going to tell you why I like wearing it like on my skin rather than over my clothes so it's all preference I know some people like to wear it over their workout clothes and some like to wear it underneath their workout clothes I prefer to wear it underneath my workout clothes because I use her um, sweat cream that goes along with the belt. So this is it right here. It is the Drenched by J Sculpt sweat cream. Y'all, when I say drenched, like this will leave you drenched and feeling amazing. So it comes in this little jar and this is a 3.5 ounce jar. So it comes in this jar right here. And it's so cute because it's like ombre color. I like it. But it looks like this inside. So it kind of looks like an ointment, but not like a heavy ointment. So it looks like that. And y'all, you only need a little bit, okay? A little bit. A little bit. When I first got it, I put it on and I used a lot. And I was like, oh, this is really tingling. So it does have a tingling sensation. That's why you only need a little bit and you apply a thin layer on it. The ingredients in it, I'm gonna read the first five so you guys know. Pomegranate extract, coconut oil, kosher jojoba oil, aloe vera extract, and vitamin E oil. And that's one thing I really like because I try to go for the more like natural route when I, you know, use things or eat things. Don't eat this. But um, <laughs> um, I like to go the natural route and this has a lot of natural ingredients in it, which is good for your skin and body. But you only need a little bit because once you put it on that thin layer and put the belt on, you will feel the nice tingling sensation. And that like y'all, I love the way that feels like after my workout, enjoy my workout. I feel like I'm working so well, I am working hard but I just feel like I'm working so hard and I'm feeling the tingly burn the the nice mild tingle burn okay um, but there's a lot of benefits to this um, this is on her website as well so if you guys are looking for a good sweat cream I highly suggest you check this one out as well so the last thing I want to show you is the resistance band by J Sculpt. So it comes in this cute little bag, which I love, so I can keep track of it, and I won't just like throw it and lose it somewhere. But y'all, this resistance band is bam. This resistance band is bomb because it is adjustable, okay? So I prefer these types of resistance bands because they're fabric, and the resist resistance on them is stronger, and it's way more durable. So you're able to use this to adjust it to make it tighter or looser. So in the video, I'm going to show you at the end of this video, um, you'll see how I incorporate this during my workouts. Um, I like to use it to target certain areas. Um, so I usually use it on my legs for leg exercises and butt exercises. Instead of increasing the weight, I'll use the band to add more intensity and focus on that area which has helped out tremendously especially when when you want to build that booty back there it really helps so um this is also on the jsculpt website um and this is like i think one of like the newer products because when i first got the first fitness um, belt um this wasn't on there yet and this wasn't on there yet either so i think these are pretty new um, and I absolutely love both of them. So overall, I use this on a regular. 
the sweat cream on a regular and the fitness belt on a regular. And also you guys, I just want to clarify that this is a fitness belt. It is not a waist trainer. A waist trainer is like the one where they have the strings in the back and you literally tie each little thing. That's waist training. That's waist training. Okay. This is a fitness belt. You are able to use this throughout your workouts. It's breathable, bendable, movable, all that. So it's different. So this is not a waist trainer. It is a fitness belt. Um, and also it does come in a range of sizes. So it comes in extra small all the way up to a 6X. Like I said, I wear a size medium. And if you want to figure out your size, just go on the website, which is linked below. And you can put your information in and it will tell you the size, which is very, very accurate because I tried it and it came out to the size and the size fit me. So yeah, you guys, so I just wanna let you guys know that I really, really love this company and I'm not just saying it. Um, I have facts, evidence. Y'all saw like I posted, um, I made a video in 2018 of me wearing the belt. I have been wearing it ever since then. I have not had any issues with it. The customer service is great. I never had any issues with that. Um, and I got real results from wearing it. And you guys, you have to just be mindful. You can't just wear the belt and you think like you're gonna get an hourglass shape or you're gonna lose all this weight. This is an aid to help you reach your goals and you have to incorporate healthy eating and workouts if you do want to reach those goals. So you can't just be wearing the belt and eating chips and not exercising and expect results. You actually have to put the work in and I promise you if you put the work in and you do all things you're supposed to do, you will see results. Like I said, I wore it for those three months when I first got it and I was so, so strict in my workouts and I ended up almost having abs, hence this boomerang again. Um, but yeah, it really, really works um, and I'm gonna keep, continue to wear it. Um, it's almost summertime, 2021, so I'm really trying to go hard and I know these times in this whole day and age, um, it's really hard to be consistent sometimes, but y'all can do it, I believe in you. Um, and just, just try it. So if you're looking for a good one, check this one out. Oh yeah, also make sure you follow me on Instagram at beautifulmorgan. Um, I'm gonna be posting more updates and workouts and all that um, on my Instagram channel, especially with the bell. And I'll be posting some more workouts on my YouTube channel below. Please let me know what kind of workouts you would like to see. Um, and I will try to produce that content for you. So I'll see you next time. Bye you guys.